In our Consumer Watchdog report tonight, it was startling to learn a number today. 120 is the answer. 120 chemicals in care products, cream shampoos, used every day by women, most of them untested, and a lot by men as well. Today, even lawmakers said it was time for a wake-up call, and ABC senior national correspondent Jim Avila has those details. The average woman applies 12 beauty products to her body every day. 120 chemicals. For men, it's six cosmetics and 80 chemicals. And few, including Betty Lee Hansen, think much about what's in them. No, I don't. Shame on me. But right now, no one has the authority to help her, not even the government. So here are some of the chemicals advocates say Americans put on their body every day. From formaldehyde, a known carcinogen, and dioxane in some shampoos, to lead on your lips, parabens possibly linked to cancer and deodorant, even mercury and skin lightening creams, toluene known to cause headaches and nail polish, and diethylphthalate linked to allergies, hormone disruption, and dermatitis in perfume. Europe has banned 1,200 such chemicals, the U.S. only 10. So critics say cosmetic makers mix a riskier brew of the same product for domestic use. Companies think that their European customers deserve safer products. There is now a move in Congress to pass a bill regulating cosmetics by summer, requiring labeling all ingredients and prohibiting chemicals linked to cancer or reproductive problems. Cosmetic companies spent three and a half million dollars lobbying against the bill, saying it would curtail innovation and compromise trade secrets. Until Congress acts, advocates recommend finding the shortest label with the fewest ingredients. And if you can't pronounce them, don't use it. Jim Avila, ABC News, Washington.